that. You've got that. Another one of those mysterious crystals. the nice dragons from Midgard. know why he was there? There were whispers that he was looking for a Vanier military outpost. I, I didn't want any trouble, so I got out quick. That's the last I saw of him, but maybe there are others who saw more. I wonder if Thor was meeting someone at the meat hall. Whoa. Do you think Thor was meeting Mom there? They never drank with me, and she would not have with him. Sometimes we never really know the ones we love, brother.
brothers. How did you manage to kill Garm anyway? We killed him a few times, actually, but it didn't take. Then I figured maybe the way to stop a soulless beast was to give it a soul. So I gave it the one I had on me. I beg your pardon? Fenrir, remember the light Father saw? The accidental magic I did when Fenrir died? That was part of Fenrir's soul going into my knife. Once I figured that out, I just put Fenrir into Garm. <laughs> Clever one, lad! A gigantic hell beast with the soul of a loyal pup. Bloody brilliant! lit up on the plate. It's because that wisp is back in its spring. Another hungry wisp. Poor gazelle. <laughs> it doesn't look like we can kill it. Maybe we can burn it instead. <laughs> What's that? You're welcome. He was nice. So the plate keeps the wisps locked in their spring. Well, except for the ones that broke loose, I guess. <laughs> Look, another wisp. It's feeding on that eye back. <laughs> Any healing? Okay, you're sure. That's all the wisps contained. Should we check out that weird plate again? Great, the runes are all lit, the wisps are back in their springs, and the plate's keeping them imprisoned. We did it! Uh, I broke that. They must have combined! We've got to take it down, Father! <laughs> Delpha! <laughs>
taken care of. But I don't understand how they escaped and formed that... thing. Chains only hold for so long. Eventually, those who wear them will break free, one way or another. You can say that again, brother. Amir, did you know Garm? Why was he locked up to begin with? Ah, hell's feral sentinel. Believe it or not, Midgard was once bigger. Until Gar, then just a wee pup got peckish. He ate Midgard? Only a few mountain ranges. And the fifth season that comes after winter but before spring. And the word for the feeling when you get so hungry, you stop being hungry. You're messing with me. I would never. Ah, another crystal. 
Best hold on to it until we can figure out what to do with it.
bloody broker. <laughs> <laughs> You're on fire, Vitos. It will pass. <laughs> Reminds me of tales of a cruel empress, one too angry to die. We will see. So, Mimir. How did they capture Garmin the first? Please. That was Tears doing. He lured the beast somewhere safe and kept it distracted by lending his own arm to be gently chewed. Once the chains were on and the gate to Elheim was opened, Garm bit Tyr's arm clean off in retribution. But Tyr's not missing an arm. Well, it grew back, eventually. He is a very resourceful god, after all. A stag of winter. Huh? It looks hungry. Come on already! Just come back with me. I don't care how hungry you are. The mayor. I know this sounds weird, but. Can you tell me again what happens when someone dies? Every living thing has a soul, and every soul has four parts. Form, mind, direction, and luck. Direction steers the souls of giants, dwarves, elves, and animals toward the Lake of Souls in Alfheim, where all the parts may be absorbed back into Alfheim's great light.
keep going this way, I believe we'll reach that air dragon's lair. Yeah. Just making sure you know where you're going. Thank you. I have to get past those vines somehow. Elka! Elka! Alka. Alka. Alka.
Ow. Alka. Alka! Elka! Alka. The way is clear. We can't get through with that bastard trying to bludge us! Then we must get closer! What's the ogre?
Meeting the Lady of the Forge really brought back some memories. I thought it was only in my homeland you'd see such things. Mermaids who forge weapons. Aye. I remember... Very fondly a late nymph called Nimni. Very talented with a sword. Mugir. I meant that literally. She not she made the best swords in all the aisles and had Wait. great Wait. Be ready for combat. Yeah! Stay quiet! Another crystal. Best hold on to it so we can figure out what to do with it.
Come here. When I was in Asgard, I saw Odin do something to some new Einherjot. He seemed kind of mindless until he cast a spell that restored their identity. Aye, that was his habit, even when they were confined to Valhalla. I think letting them remember themselves was another small way of cheating death any way you could. Go but further, we'll be right on top of the ogre. Better be sure we're ready. We fight! Yeah, I got that! On your left! God. It went back to its perch. Let's go after it. I try to ask this. There's stories Odin told me, like how he lost his eye, where the details are different from stories you've told me. And I trust you, of course, but they don't seem like things you'd have a reason to lie about either. One thing to remember about liars, lad, they lie. They do it on principle. No issue too big or too small. They lie about anything they can get away with and some things that they can't just to demonstrate their power over reality. You must all. Always bear that in mind. What's the deal with Odin's ravens? They can just transport him anywhere? Except for the realm between realms, thankfully. Why? Harder to find, thanks to dwarven enchantments, 
and Yggdrasil's very own nature. Hmm. Lucky us. Pass open. That dragon is shaking in its scaly boots, I suspect. Once we approach the dragon, we will kill or be killed. Understood? Yes, Father. Come on! not getting up anytime soon either I can hear the animals they're relieved maybe they'll come out of hiding and with that we've now taken down about half the dragons in this crater as well huh I can hear the birds they're rooting for us that's nice <laughs> 